Okay, this is just another quick video in our uh, Flash Player installation series. Um, this one in particular is to deal with how to install uh, the Adobe Flash Player on the Apple Safari browser. Okay, The four main browsers that we find that people use to view our website are Internet Explorer, Mozilla Firefox, uh, Google Chrome and Apple Safari. Okay, So we're just going to do a series of videos on how to show you um, how to install uh, the Flash Player because people have asked us over time um, you know they, they can't get the videos to work uh, either on YouTube or our own website and 99% of the time even more um, it's because they don't have the correct version of Adobe Flash Player installed so we're just going to take you through quickly how to do this um, how to do this process okay so this is uh, in particular to do deal with uh, Apple Safari okay so as you can see I've Apple Safari open at the moment and I'm on the Google home page so if you just type in flash into the search bar there okay the top result that comes back for flash is the Adobe flash player installation uh, page okay so what you want to do is just click into it okay and you'll see here then you'll see the Adobe flash player version 10.1.1 or 2.64 and um, that's the very latest version and um, you can see it's 2.66 megabytes okay so we're just going to click download now okay so it's uh it just come up there and said thank you it will start automatically okay so it comes up here file download a security warning do you want to run or save this file now files that begin or end with .exe can have security issues and there can be all sorts of nasties um in them but in general they're okay and definitely if you're downloading it from a reputable site like uh, like adobe um you you will have no problem with it at all okay so we definitely want to run this okay so that's kind of pops up another window then wanting to make sure do you definitely want to run this file so we we definitely do so we're just going to click run okay so we want to agree to the terms of the license agreement and we want to go click install okay so <coughs> excuse me the next box that comes up saying uh, needs basically uh, the browser to be shut before it'll continue installing so what we're going to do is we're going to shut the browser and then you'll notice in this box here this writing will change and you'll see it being installed okay so to shut the to shut Apple Safari we want to follow the mouse here and go over to the top right to the big red X and we're going to click on that but at the same time the box I was previously in keep an eye on that okay so I'm just going to click it now to shut it once it's shut oh sorry we'll have to click this down or just shut this downloads window as well okay so there you can see it installing okay so it comes up with the installation is complete and we want to click done okay so that's it installed on apple safari so i'm just going to open up the safari window again and we're back to the google home page so what we want to do is we want to go to the tvtrade.ie home page and we'll go into the combined digital receivers okay so we'll go into the edison argus mini and we'll just scroll down now on all our products we have a load of tabs um just below the the you know the price and the quantities and things like this and they're to do with um you know the, uh, product descriptions there might be files um that you can download related to the product things like that but one of the key things we have and is unique to our site is our video our video um instructional manuals and things like that okay so we're just going to go into the user manual tab here and if we scroll down then you'll see a video and text on uh, various things to do with the other sign okay so things like uh, changing the language um, how to you know how to find um, terrestrial channels with auto scans things like this but for just for these purposes we're just going to show you how to install the Edison Argus Mini uh, it's basically just to show you the video working after we have it installed so there you go you can see the video starting to play okay so I'm just going to pause it here now so that's basically from beginning to end how to how to install the Adobe flash player on Apple Safari browsers